part of the Vikings' success this year is a defensive line that is getting after the quarterback. And tonight they will have a new target. The Chicago Bears are starting Mitch Trubinsky as quarterback. This is his first NFL game. And one person hoping to welcome to the big show is Limbaugh Joseph. What is the pride of a defensive line? You know, when I say that, what does that mean to you? That, that, that it seems like you guys are kind of a team amongst yourself. It's a combination of everything you were just saying. Just being together with the same guys for four years, five years, seven years, knowing each other, and just coming together in the same scheme too as well. Can that only happen when you play together for a long time? Is that the way it has to evolve? I mean, you know how the NFL goes. Every It's the tale of each week. And each week we try to be consistent and try to be on top, but you can't control the outcome. All of you have been paid in one way, shape, or form. We got at least one big contract. Does that make it easier to just go out and perform? I mean, it makes it easier, and hard work pays off. We work, everybody on this team worked their butt off. And D -line, it starts up front, O-line, D-line, and we just try to be the best we can really be. Andre Patterson is a defensive line coach, and he tells me that uh, you flat out can take over the line of scrimmage like no one in the NFL, that you are at times the best at your position. What does that mean when you hear that? I mean, it means a lot to me. I work really, really hard. And just to get recognition and just getting better every year, that's, that's the goal. People think of a big run stopper, you know, big guy like that. Um, but the truth is, you take great pride in having at one time been quite an athlete growing up. Man, I was, don't like to brag or anything, but I did a lot of sports in Florida. Um, basketball, football, track and field, weightlifting. I played a little bit of tennis. So, tennis? Yeah, I like tennis. Come tennis, on now. tennis is actually pretty fun. Who would play tennis against you? Man, I love tennis, man. It's a great conditioning. You have family in Florida, and obviously the hurricane went through there. How, how did they come out on that, and what was that like for you? Um, yes, my mom, my dad, my mom, my brother, they both live in Florida. And my dad lives in the Virgin Islands. And as you know, Puerto Rico, St. Croix, St. Thomas took a pretty bad hit. Everybody's good yeah. for the most part. My dad is here, actually, and I'm glad he's here, and I'm glad his house is OK. But a lot of people die. A lot of people don't still have power for the next two months. And it's, it's kind of hard. It's, it's, Hard all to take in at one time. Big games like tonight, national TV, all that goes with it, Chicago Bears. What's it like for a player? It's everything for a player. You have the whole world looking at you. And that's the day you want to shine and you want to be the best you can for your team and for yourself. Division games are big. These, this is the reason why we play this, this sport, this game, for the division games. That's you want to win the division. That's one step to make it to the Super Bowl. And a reminder to keep it right here all night for your Vikings coverage. Our special pregame show starts at 7, and then you can watch the game right here on WCCL.